PostgreSQL join is used to combine columns from one or more tables based on the values of the common columns between related tables. The common columns are typically the primary key columns of the first table and foreign key columns of the second table. PostgreSQL supports the basic type of joins, which are inner join, left outer join, right outer join, and full outer join. It also has special joins such as natural join, cross join, and self join. Let's start with the basic joins first. The inner join creates a new result table by combining column values of two tables, table one and table two, based upon the join predicate. The query compares each row of table one with each row of table two to find all pairs of rows which satisfy the join predicate. When the join predicate is satisfied, column values for each match pair of rows of table one and table two are combined into a result row. As we can observe from the Venn diagram, the inner join only outputs the common records between the tables. An inner join is the most common type of join and is the default type of join. You can use inner keyword optionally. The following is the syntax of inner join. Select space table one dot column one comma space table two dot column two space from space table one space inner space join space table two space on space table one dot common underscore field space equals space table two dot common underscore field semicolon. To demonstrate the different types of joins, we are going to use the zoo underscore one and zoo underscore two table, which contains two columns, ID and animal. In these two tables, we have two common animals and four different ones. To create an inner join, type the following script. Select, next line, zoo underscore one dot ID space ID underscore A comma. Next line, zoo underscore one dot animal space animal underscore a comma. Next line, zoo underscore two dot id space id underscore b comma. Next line, zoo underscore two dot animal space animal underscore b. Next line, from. Next line, zoo underscore one. Next line, inner space join space zoo underscore two space on space zoo underscore one dot animal space equals zoo underscore two dot animal semicolon. Run the script once done. As we can see from the output, the result of the inner join resulted in two records, lion and tiger. Since these are the records which areas are available on both zoo underscore one and zoo underscore two table, the records that are not matched will not be included in this type of join. The outer join is an extension of the inner join. SQL standard defines three types of outer joins, left, right, and full. And PostgreSQL supports all of these. In case of the left outer join, an inner join is performed first. Then for each row in table T1 that does not satisfy the join condition with any row in table T2. A joined row is added with null values in columns of T2. Thus the joined table always has at least one row for each row in T1. As we can observe from the Venn diagram, all records from the T1 or left table will be included in the output regardless if they have a matching record or not. The following is the syntax of left outer join. Select space columns space from space table one space left space outer space join space table two space on space table one dot common underscore field space equals space table two dot common underscore field semicolon. Let's apply a left outer join in our zoo tables. In the PostgreSQL type, select, next line, 
zoo underscore one dot id comma next line zoo underscore one dot animal comma next line zoo underscore two dot id comma next line zoo underscore two dot animal next line from next line zoo underscore one next line left space join space zoo underscore two space on space zoo underscore one dot animal space equals space zoo underscore two dot animal semicolon execute the script once done as we can see from the output the left outer join generated all four records from the left table if the record has a match on the zoo underscore two table its matching records can be seen in the second id and animal column records which are unique to zoo underscore one table will have null records in these two columns the right outer join works exactly the opposite to the left outer join first an inner join is performed then for each row in table two that does not satisfy the join condition with any row in table one a joined row is added with null values in the columns of t1 this is the converse of a left join the result table will always have a row for each row in t2 as we can see from the diagram it outputs all of the records from the right regardless if they have a matching record or not the syntax of a right outer join is as follows select space columns space from space table one space right space outer space join space table two space on space table one dot common underscore field space equals space table two dot common underscore field semicolon to create a right outer join type this script in the query window select next line zoo underscore one dot id comma next line zoo underscore one dot animal comma next line zoo underscore two dot id comma next line zoo underscore two dot animal next line from next line zoo underscore one next line right space join space zoo underscore two space on space zoo underscore one dot animal space equals space zoo underscore two dot animal semicolon run the script once typed in the data output window all four records of the zoo underscore two table are listed the matching records on zoo underscore one can also be seen in the first instance of the id and animal column the last type of the basic joins is the full outer join the full outer join or full join returns a result set that contains all rows from both the left and right tables first an inner join is performed then for each row in table t1 that does not satisfy the join condition with any row in table 2 a joined row is added with null values in columns of t2 in addition for each row of t2 that does not satisfy the join condition with any row in t1 a joined row with null values in the columns of t1 is added the venn diagram shows us that it outputs all records from both tables regardless if they match or not its syntax is select space columns space from space table one space full space outer space join space table two space on space table one dot common underscore field space equals space table two dot common underscore field semicolon to apply a full outer join in our zoo table type in select next line zoo underscore one dot id comma next line zoo underscore one dot animal comma next line zoo underscore two dot id comma next line zoo underscore two dot animal next line from next line zoo underscore one next line full space join space zoo underscore two space on space zoo underscore one dot animal space equals space zoo underscore two dot animal semicolon as we can see from the output all records from both zoo underscore one and zoo underscore two tables are generated 
all records from the zoo underscore one are shown in the first ID and animal column, with the two matching animals on zoo two in the consecutive columns. Since wolf and fox are not available in zoo underscore two, the other side is null. On the other hand, panther and rhino are only available in the zoo underscore two table, so it is listed on the second ID and animal column, but null on the first one. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full course that this video came from, click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.